So for our next progression, Tyler's now gonna have a dot in his hand because he's going to put out another visual for when he takes a step back. So he's gonna take one big step back behind the dot from where he was just kneeling. Then he's gonna take one big step to his right. Then he's gonna put the dot down by his feet. Now he knows this is where he has to get back every single time he's doing this motion. So he's gonna straddle the dot right now. And what's gonna happen, my target never changes. So the first target that we created with the dot in the center of the four squares, that's where I'm throwing again. But now Tyler's starting back, so he has to cut off this ball. He's staying on his feet. So he's gonna take a step right into the box. I want his toe finishing on the corner of the box, closest to him. All right, I'll look like this. And as a thrower, it's super important. Don't throw it high because he's back there. That doesn't do him any justice. Throw it down. He's cutting this ball off. Throw it at the dot. So for the next round, he's just gonna go to the other side, working on taking a step off his right. Again, you just take a step back from the middle dot and then to your left. Now we're stepping into the box with our right foot. Make sure we're not crossing our feet and his foot is getting into the box, not behind it. And then our arms will be over our leg. All right, if you want to start hitting, you are allowed to just make sure that you are actually hitting the target. It's very important. If not, just keep throwing, right? Your toss is super important to work on good skills and not hitting it crazy and working on bad skills, all right? So big keys when actually taking a step and cutting off the ball, a lot of people like to go to their left or to their right instead of actually cutting it off at a 45 degree angle. So that is the importance of having the box in front of you. So if Tyler was to take a step with his right right now into the box, I wanna then make sure I'm shooting my platform to go over my knees. So I'm here contacting this ball. I don't wanna be low into my knees. That hence why we did everything to start off on our knees to begin with. So he's gonna Stay back, he's gonna take a step, shoot his arms, and then he can put his platform together. You don't wanna be together shooting because then we're swinging or we're adding too much rotation on this ball when we can just take a nice easy step, throw, pass.